howdy y'all i'm sitting next to a campfire shivering in the windy blustery evening i'm at uh, a campground in an undisclosed location it's actually lake kachuma uh, across the mountains from santa barbara and uh it's almost december so it's not a surprise to be chilly uh, it's windier than I expected, blustery, which I should expect. The wind blows off the uh, lake, which is right behind me, right back there. You just can't see it. Um, anyway, tonight, I reach into my chair cooler. It's a nice little Coleman that has slots for three drinks. Eight, four, I don't know. Uh, do some drinking. It's a Jack Daniels Down Home Punch. It contains alcohol. <laughs> Jack Daniels, who would have thunk? Um, I don't know. Maybe I'll enjoy it. Maybe I'll finish it. Maybe I won't. 4.8% alcohol. Uh, the little store here is a nice little store. Uh, seems to be under new management, though. Prices have gone up. Things have changed a little bit. Um, anyway, they, they've uh, they had some decent six packs, but I have a little three pack cooler, and I'm not going to down three beers tonight. Um, I didn't wasn't interested in the forty the forties of uh, Modelo and whatever else they had. They had a cup, one or two uh, craft brews. I've had them. Uh, they had the little tiny balls of liquor that I've tried once and wasn't impressed, although there was a espresso martini that I was interested in. But, yeah, I went with the 16 ounce Jack Daniels down home punch and uh, before I'm to now there's a, also a restaurant here they just opened a bar uh, since last time I was here and uh, the bar is nice and uh, they had celebration Sierra Nevada celebration on uh, uh, I open it and it smells like Kool-Aid um, should have expected that too. No one ever expects the Spanish Inquisition. Um, or was I? Oh, hooked. H O O K apostrophe D is the restaurant. Um, um, like I said, the new bar. They had Sierra Nevada celebration, which I love. Uh, a couple of IPAs and local brews. I should have probably got something there on tap, yeah, not to go. Um, but I thought the store would have something different. Anyway, let's taste the Kool-Aid. Tastes like Kool-Aid. Down home punch. Yeah, it's punchy. Um, it's a it's a alcapop as they called it in Utah. <clears throat> Excuse me, fruit flavored drink. And yeah, it won't four point eight percent. I'd have to down like all they had in the store even make me a little tipsy it just make me sick to my stomach first if you like uh, fruit punch with a little bit of alcohol in it it's your thing um, that sickly sickly sweet thing just ain't my thing um, 
I doubt I'll finish it. I might if I'm thirsty enough. But um, yeah, sickeningly sweet. That's my. And I'd probably feel the same way if it was a whole thing of Kool Aid. I've got water. I've got. Uh, I, is that Under Armour? No. Body Armour drink, which I enjoy those, especially when I have caffeine. And I've got a. You could have had a V8. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, that's where we are. Uh, trying to keep warm. You, you can't see it, but. My hammock is set up on my uh, Amukdramore stand behind me. Um, I don't need trees. It's awesome. There's videos of me testing it and trying different hammocks. Um, using my War Bonnet Traveler tonight with a, I think a Wise Owl under under quilt. Uh, I only, only my second time using the under quilt. Uh, find out if under quilt's the way to go, like you guys say, you experts. Um, tonight it's supposed to get down to like 35 at least. So I'll definitely be finding out. Um, I've, got, I've got plenty of stuff to keep me warm on top. Uh, the motorcycle's over there. It's running good. Oh, the moon's come out. Maybe the wind will die down. It is blustery. Anyway, um, that's it. It's, uh, on a one to five. This would be, a I don't know. Two and a half, maybe two and a quarter. It's uh, it's fruit punch. Ah, yeah, that's it. Uh, thanks for watching. I'm gonna bundle up and snuggle to get up a little closer to the fire because it's cold. So, thanks for watching. Y'all have a great day and cheers.